Speaking with George, who's details on a doctor at St. Christopher's Hospital for Children who has a confirmed case of coronavirus. George. Yeah, Walter and Sarah, we want to make it clear that the hospital is open. Now, the name of the doctor has not been released, but we do know that doctor worked in the ICU here on March 9th through the 11th. Now, the hospital says they are taking necessary precautions to protect patients and staff currently here at the ICU or anyone else that's been treated here. An already challenging environment for the staff at St. Christopher's Hospital for Children, now a bit more complex in the era of COVID-19. Today, hospital officials announcing a doctor at the hospital was diagnosed with a case of the virus. In a letter to patients, hospital officials say they learned of the case Friday and that the unnamed physician worked in the intensive care unit on March 9th through March 11th. The letter going on to say the infection was not acquired in the hospital. Officials have said they are working with the Philadelphia Department of Health to determine who the doctor may have come into contact with. Saturday, steps were immediately taken at the hospital to keep patients safe. Among some of the changes, the ICU is now closed to new admissions. The level one trauma department is closed. Children in the ICU will not be transferred. ICU staff will wear surgical masks outside patient rooms and non-essential staff will not be allowed in the ICU. This now the second case of a doctor in the region potentially exposing patients to the virus. Last week, Montgomery County officials announced a doctor from the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia Outpatient Care Center in King of Prussia exposed more than a dozen patients. That prompted a series of closures around the area and specialized cleanings. As far as what comes next now, that's contact tracing, figuring out who that doctor may have been in contact with and making sure those employees stay home for the next 14 days.